Well, 815 later this morning, investigators are expected to release more details about a massive fire in Anderson. The fire started at the post office and caused millions of dollars in damage. Fox Carolina's Grace Runkle tells us what we might hear from investigators in today's uh, press conference. Grace. Well, Ted, those investigators with the ATF, they're already back on scene this morning. They've been here since about 7 o'clock this morning, busy getting back into the remnants of the building behind me. In fact, I'll move out of the way so you can kind of see what they're doing and what's left of this strip mall here on Clemson Boulevard in Anderson. You can see major parts of the building are just completely destroyed after Sunday's fire. The fire started around 8 o'clock Sunday morning and investigators say the flame started in the Anderson post office but quickly spread. It damaged six stores in the strip mall causing three million dollars in damage. SLED and Postal Inspection Service investigators are also involved in this investigation. A spokesperson for ATF says it's standard procedure for several departments to work together when you have a fire this size because it takes a lot of manpower and a lot of equipment to really narrow down where that fire exactly started and what the cause of it was. And those are exactly those two questions that we're hoping to maybe get some answers to today. What caused the fire and exactly where it started? The press conference starts at 11 o'clock this morning. And of course, we will be here getting the latest details. And as soon as we have them, we'll report those back to you. Right now, though, I'll send it over for a look at the weather.